Hello world folks, it's good to see you all here again. This is your regular dose of world news and analysis. Before we move on to any further details, I'd really love to thank you all for enormous love and support. And in case you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for guys? Hit that subscribe button now and don't forget to press that bell icon. On November 9th, 2022, Meghan Markle left the house to cast her ballot in US midterm elections. Once more, Meghan Markle is leaving her imprint on the political scene and it's creating quite a commotion. The midterm elections, which will determine who holds seats in the House of Representatives and the Senate, has the authority to enact legislation across the country or encourage to be voted in by the Duchess of Sussex. Following Meghan Markle's participation in the 2018 U.S. midterm elections and her request that Americans exercise the right to vote on November 9, 2022, King Charles is now facing calls to revoke the Duchess of Sussex title that belongs to his daughter-in-law. According to the report published on Wednesday, Meghan visited a voting place to cast her ballot in U.S. midterm elections. She also shared a photo of herself on the Archroll website wearing a voted tag on her shirt. In addition to sharing the image on the website, Meghan and Prince Harry also left a statement encouraging Americans to use their right to vote by stating today's election day in the U.S. Time to cast your ballot. To identify your voting place, make sure you are prepared to vote. Text Archwell to 26797. Americans and royal aficionados were outraged by the Duke and Duchess of Sussex's decision to get involved in U.S. politics, especially as royals. Members of the royal family are often expected to maintain their political neutrality. A Twitter critic wrote, Strip their titles now. This is awfully out of place. Meghan Markle is able to cast a ballot, but this voter registration drive is inappropriate for a princess. Now, Charles, take away the title of Duchess of Sussex. She's uninformed, can see about her royal status which reflects poorly on you, the user continued. I don't disagree with what she says about voting here, wrote another Twitter user in response. As long as she holds a British royal title, she shouldn't be able to swear our election anyway, thanks to her status her title confers. Many people urging others to cast ballots, we won't miss Meghan's voice. Although senior royals have the legal right to vote, they're typically expected to maintain neutrality in political debates. Given that Harry and Meghan resigned from their roles as working royals before relocating to the United States in January 2020, the situation is undoubtedly more difficult now. King Charles has been quite outspoken on a number of subjects throughout the years, while the late Queen Elizabeth abstained from voting, albeit this was due to tradition rather than real prohibition. When Meghan cast her ballot in the 2020 U.S. elections, she became the first modern royal to take part in the United States presidential election. So what do you guys think about this news? Should Meghan lose her title as the Duchess of Sussex? Write it down in the comment section below and let me know what you think. Until then, I guess we'll just have to wait and see if things turn out to be something after all. Also, if you never want to miss any of my sizzling royal updates like this, subscribe and press that bell icon. It's as simple as that. So until next time, hasta la vista.